Life is a big challenge. I will try to defeat you, but you have to win. Difficult roads leads to beautiful destination. At the end, it's not the years in your life that count, but the life in your years that count. What a beautiful quotation, right? Like every one of you, even I have grown up by listening them. We always get motivated. Sometimes get goosebumps by listening this, right? We feel we are the champions. We can do anything. Imagine someone is saying, "Once upon a time, there lived a lion in the forest." How do you feel? A mind becomes fresh. We start listening to it. But what will happen after few days? Again, a routine life. Same school, same classroom, homeworks, punishments, etc. We finally forget. Good morning to one and all. I'm a typical Indian girl from orthodox middle class family. My father is a goldsmith and my mother is a housemaker. I have grown up by listening beautiful stories said by my mother and wonderful motivational quotations by my father and the same continued till the day. But now all the stories are turned into boring philosophies. Now it is I'm just listening this. Varshita, you should be well dressed. Varshita, you should do puja every day. Varshita, you should study well. Varshita, you should get first time get it done. Varshita, you should do this. Varshita, you should do not do that. Varshita, Varshita, Varshita. Seriously, to be frank, I'm hating my name nowadays. Even the scolding from my parents are seeming me to be like motivational quotes for me, as I'm forgetting them within a less time. But when I look back and think all of my journey with my parents, every story they said was like me new blessings for me. Which thought I have to be in my life. It reminds me what is good and what is bad. But what I am doing just listening for the sake of listening and enjoying it for some time. But when we look into the no meaning it, we. It's all the experiences which tell us stories and, ex and, and explain what life is. It took very less time for me to understand this. The day I released myself the, and the day I, I changed myself, I started observing people some, and, and how they respond. Some of my classmates are the real actors. If we send them to act in movies, they'll get Oscar award for India. One, one example, I can give my friend Spandana. When the lecture is going on, Spandana stares at the teacher. The teacher feels she is a brilliant kid who never misses anything in the classroom. But when I asked Spandana, what did she understand? She said, who is listening to the class? Friends, that is what is happening with most of us. We just act like we are listening most of the things. We just behave. We understand everything. But when we look into the reality, we never. If we listen everything, we are forgetting it within a less time. Major reason for this, we are not questioning why. Why it is useful for me if I understand this. We never forget anything. On the special days, we should not forget the famous line said by Abdul Kalam. The key to success is to focus on goals, not obstacles. You can't stop me in telling motivational quotations because it's, because it's in my blood. It's me, Varshita, with the hope of achieve the best. Thank you. Over to the host.